do any of that kind of crazy stuff, which I don't really have to do all that often, but if you do, it's okay if you're getting paid. <laughs> says very clearly, honey, you're a whore, not a slut. We got to play with things. Those jokes did not translate very well from Japanese into English, so we got to have some fun with it. And being the sick dude that I am, that was just right up my alley. Um, we had to look up terminology for boobs and found 1,200 different terms. For it. So that was fun. Uh, but really, you know, like I was explaining earlier to somebody that. Uh, when you're doing a show, and I wrote a lot of the show too, so I'm sitting at home trying to translate, or trying to work on this translated jokes, and they don't exactly work in the food. Now at 2 o'clock in the morning while I'm by myself writing a joke at home, it's hysterical. <laughs> Get into the booth, and it sort of loses some of its punch. You know? So we worked in time to improvise, so we had a blast. Loved it. It was so cool. Um, Okay, that being said, it looks like we are about at capacity, am I right? Yep. All right, cool. So, I'm going to go back real fast before we move on to more questions, and I'm gonna say the thing that I said before that have you heard, which is that only ask interesting questions. <laughs> you ask a stupid question? Stupid answer! Stupid answer. That's what's gonna happen. Don't embarrass yourself. Don't do it. It's funny, I see more hands go up than drop. Yeah. Um, okay, James, pick somebody. Faster than that, James. Like, did you ever throw your voice when other people were talking, like, behind the walls and things like that? Oh, no, I couldn't throw my voice. I tried to. Um, I never considered voice acting as a job. I didn't think that it was a thing, you know? But, you know, I'm not a voice actor, I'm an actor. Voice acting is just one of the things I do, you know? And that's what everyone needs to understand. Acting is acting. Just act wherever you are. And so when I was a kid, I just wanted to be an actor. I didn't care where I acted. I still don't. So if somebody wants to hire me to do voice acting, I'm gonna do voice acting. Somebody wants to hire me to be on stage, I'll be on stage. I just like doing it. <coughs> acting. <laughs> and that other thing too. <laughs> Stretcher. Way back, red hat. Hi there, Eric. This is a twofold question. Hold on, James is running to you. I'm really giving him a hard time. This is more or less a two-parter. One, what's your take on the Brody scene? And number two, can you look improv of America and Canada as sportscasters? Stupid question thing. It's one of them. Brodies. <laughs> really? Okay. Who who likes who likes my little pony? Thank you. So this is a six-year-old girl. <laughs> right, right, right. And they're 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 
there's some dudes over there like, thank you, right? Let's go drink a beer, right? No bronies. respect for the people who work on the show, and I love what's being done, and I think it's a fantastic show for my six-year-old girl. It really, really annoys me that I know 35, 45, 50-year-old men who think that it is the greatest thing and has all this really deep, deep meaning. No, you're stupid! It doesn't! It's a Dish some crap out to somebody, somebody takes a little crap with some, some guts. <laughs> Reward. <laughs> so, uh, I don't know how to do that. Uh, okay, so it's like, uh, It has one of the ballsiest endings of any movie ever. You could not, you've seen it, you could not make that movie today with that ending. At all. They, you wouldn't do it. A studio would shut you down. The studio would stop that ending from happening. And that's why I love it. Because in the 70s, you could do some of the craziest stuff. You know? Including some guy saying, you know what? I know my marriage is kind of on the rocks and I should really stay here for my kids, but I'm going to go hang out with these aliens. <laughs> so. Oh, oh, spoiler alert. Uh, <laughs> By the way, I think spoiler alerts for movies that have been out longer than a lot of people have been alive don't count. <laughs> If you haven't seen Jaws by now, they killed the shark. Hey, guess what? Guess what? Bruce Willis is dead in the sixth sense the whole time. Yeah. 
said, I'm doing this show, I think you would be good at it. And they audition all the time, call this guy for an audition. I called him, I got an audition. Three weeks later, they called me specifically to audition for Trunks, and then I was cast as Trunks, I think, the next day. That was in 2000. So it was that long ago, and I've been doing that ever since. Um, okay, James, pick somebody from over here. 